Navratri is one of the most vibrant and colorful festivals celebrated in India. It is observed for nine consecutive days to worship and celebrate the divine feminine energy or Devi. Navratri is celebrated in various ways in different parts of the country, and each region has its unique rituals, customs, and traditions that showcase the rich cultural diversity of India. One of the significant elements of Navratri is the jewelry worn during this festival. Women adorn themselves with different types of jewelry made of precious and semi-precious gemstones. These gemstones have a special significance in Navratri, and each stone is associated with one of the nine forms of Goddess Durga. In this video, we will explore the gemstones and jewelry worn during Navratri, their significance, and their healing properties. Ruby is a red-colored gemstone that represents sun, vitality, and energy. It is also associated with the first day of Navratri and the goddess Shalaputri, who was worshipped on this day. The color red signifies strength, courage, and determination, and wearing ruby jewelry during Navratri is believed to enhance these attributes in a person. Ruby is also known for its healing properties. It is said to improve blood circulation, reduce inflammation, and enhance concentration and focus. Ruby is also known to boost the immune system and promote self-confidence and positivity. Pearl is a white-colored gemstone that represents the purity and beauty of goddess Brahmakarini, who is worshipped on the second day of Navratri. Pearl jewelry is believed to strengthen the mind and enhance inner peace and stability. Pearl is also known for its healing properties. It is said to reduce stress and anxiety, promote healing and rejuvenation, and enhance fertility and emotional balance. Pearl is also believed to promote good sleep and calmness in the wearer. Yellow Sapphire is a yellow-colored gemstone that represents the power and grace of goddess Chandraganta, who is worshipped on the third day of Navratri. The color yellow signifies prosperity, happiness, and success, and wearing yellow sapphire jewelry during Navratri is believed to attract these positive energies. Yellow sapphire is also known for its healing properties. It is said to promote mental clarity, enhance creativity and self-expression, and relieve stress and tension. Yellow sapphire is also believed to promote physical and emotional well-being and bring good luck and fortune to the wearer. Emerald is a green-colored gemstone that represents the vitality and growth of goddess Kushmanda, who is worshipped on the fourth day of Navratri. The color green signifies harmony, balance, and renewal, and wearing emerald jewelry during Navratri is believed to promote these qualities in a person. Emerald is also known for its healing properties. It is said to promote physical and emotional healing, improve memory and communication skills, and enhance spiritual awareness and intuition. Emerald is also believed to promote harmony and balance in relationships and bring prosperity and abundance to the wearer. Diamond is a colorless gemstone that represents the clarity and purity of goddess Skandamata, who was worshipped on the fifth day of Navratri. The colorless nature of diamonds signifies purity, innocence, and honesty, and wearing diamond jewelry during Navratri is believed to enhance these attributes in a person. Diamond is also known for its healing properties. It is said to promote courage and strength, improve mental clarity and focus, and enhance creativity and self-expression. Diamond is also believed to promote physical and emotional healing and bring clarity and purity into relationships. Blue Sapphire is a blue-colored gemstone that represents the power and protection of goddess Kadyayani, who was worshipped on the sixth day of Navratri. The color blue signifies calmness, serenity, and protection, and wearing blue sapphire jewelry during Navratri is believed to attract these energies. Blue Sapphire is also known for its healing properties. It is said to promote mental clarity and focus, relieve anxiety and depression, and enhance intuition and spiritual awareness. Blue Sapphire is also believed to promote physical and emotional healing and protect the wearer from negative energies and influences.
Red coral is a red-colored gemstone that represents the energy and enthusiasm of goddess Kalaratri, who is worshipped on the seventh day of Navratri. The color red signifies strength, courage, and determination, and wearing red coral jewelry during Navratri is believed to enhance these attributes in a person. Red coral is also known for its healing properties. It is said to improve the immune system, enhance physical strength and vitality, and promote emotional balance and stability. Red coral is also believed to protect the wearer from negative energies and enhance creativity and self-expression. Hesonite is a brown to orange colored gemstone that represents the protection and stability of goddess Mahagori, who is worshipped on the eighth day of Navratri. The color brown signifies grounding, stability, and protection, and wearing Hesonite jewelry during Navratri is believed to attract these energies. Hesonite is also known for its healing properties. It is said to promote physical and emotional healing, improve concentration and focus, and enhance intuition and spiritual awareness. Hesonite is also believed to protect the wearer from negative energies and enhance self-confidence and determination. Cat's eye is a greenish-yellow to brownish-yellow gemstone that represents the wisdom and enlightenment of goddess Siddhadatri, who is worshipped on the ninth day of Navratri. The color yellow signifies wisdom, enlightenment, and spiritual growth, and wearing cat's eye jewelry during Navratri is believed to attract these energies. Cat's eye is also known for its healing properties. It is said to improve intuition and spiritual awareness, promote mental clarity and focus, and enhance creativity and self-expression. Cat's eye is also believed to protect the wearer from negative energies and promote self-confidence and determination. Navratri is a festival that celebrates the divine feminine energy and the triumph of good over evil. The jewelry worn during this festival is not just for adornment, but also a way to connect with the different aspects of Goddess Durga and attract positive energies. Each gemstone has a special significance in Navratri and is associated with one of the nine forms of Goddess Durga. The healing properties of these gemstones are also significant and can enhance physical, emotional, and spiritual well-being. Celebrate Navratri in style with these beautiful gemstones and jewelry and connect with the divine energy of Goddess Durga. Be sure to like this video and click to subscribe to see more content.